Something very big is going to happen between now and September 30th. Now also, September 24th is a big, big date that all of you need to pay attention to for a lot of reasons that we're going to cover in today's video. So this video is extremely important because there is a doomsday theory on The Simpsons show that is going viral right now. And this is supposed to happen on September 24th and the next week can be absolutely absolutely crazy. Now, why do I say that? I'm going to play you the clip of The Simpsons right here in which they showed this doomsday theory and why you should pay attention. Now, also, we're going to play this video right here from the Chancellor the chancellor addressing the German parliament on Ukraine, okay? This is the chancellor right here, and he mentions that September 24th, 2022, will be a day that we all remember where we were, okay? So this video is extremely important. Now, a few more things are happening on September 30th. Also, Pope Francis, the actual Pope, instructed Vatican entities to move all their money, all their funds to Vatican banks by September 30th. Now, why would he do that? Maybe the electric grid is going to go down for countries around the world and he wanted to make sure that all of the money was within the Vatican to be protected. Maybe, I don't know. But also, the Pope has declared that mankind is experiencing the outbreak of World War III right now. So it would not be surprising if countries are trying to attack each other on the electric grid. Now, I'm going to play this clip right here because this is very important. So listen to what the German parliament, the German chancellor had to say to the parliament, the EU parliament, because this is very important. Listen to this. These are Dear colleagues, this 24th of September 2022 will be a day that remains in our memory as a day we will say, I remember exactly where I was. He remembers exactly where he was on September 24th, 2022. Now, this is important because there's also another Simpsons episode that came out on season or it was episode nine, season 24. So it could mean that September 24, because September is number nine and 24 is 24. So look at this clip right here. It's a few minutes, real quick. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. The rule of law. Well, that's W-R-O-L. It means without the rule of law, anarchy, the end of civilization. Coming soon to an American near you. America can't collapse. Where is powerful as ancient Rome? <laughs> One thing real quick, I'm, I'm going to play this, the rest of this clip, but that is a common theme with every great civilization, every great nation to ever come and go into this world thought that they were the greatest at one point. And I love America. I love Russians. I love Ukrainians. I love Chinese people. I love people from all over the world. But that is one thing that Americans see themselves as number one and they can never collapse. And that's kind of going to help with their downfall in many ways. Now, I say they. I'm an American. You know, I have an American passport and other passports also. But that is one way that P Americans see themselves. They're like, oh, we're number one forever. And honestly, that kind of takes away from your hunger. And when you're not hungry no more, you're not motivated to keep improving. And when you don't keep improving, other countries are right behind you looking to be number one. So the average American today in 2022, the average teenager has no idea what's going on around the world. They're not educated properly. They only know one language as opposed to like, I've been traveling the world this whole year and I see many people from all over the world that know how to speak English and their home language and usually another third language. And Americans in many ways are stuck in a little bubble keeping up with the Kardashians instead of improving. But anyways, let's keep going with this Simpsons clip. What do you do in the case of an EMP? Electromagnetic pulse. A burst of radiation that knocks out every electrical system in the country. Impending doom. What do you mean, Dad? Ah! Honey, everything's fine. There's nothing to worry about. When things go south, the sheeple will clean out every supermarket in town. Typical sheeple. So, what have you learned so far from our post-apocalyptic movie marathon? Guys who call themselves preacher or deacon are very bad. Water is money, unless gasoline is money, and even though lots of things are razor sharp, no one ever shaves. 
Hollywood has taught you well, my son. Here it is, Owen. The Springfield Trapper's top secret bug out retreat. Wow, your end of the world is better than my during the world. <laughs> Palmer, we all know America's collapse is about three months away. Six weeks at most. There's always one alarmist. Anyway, when the four horsemen arrive, we want you and your collaterals right here with us. And all our supplies behind a fake wall. Fuck the basement, look, Wilma. See? These are our bug out bags. In here is everything we need to survive. Survive so what? The little man cup bluey. It's reassuring to see our way out of the future, but this is all a little creepy. Creepy? Mark, the apocalypse is coming. Maybe not tomorrow, maybe never. But it's coming. And soon. I'm going to bed. <gasps> An EMP? You know what that means? Hand scissors. <laughs> Look at this. I'm hungry. Perfect timing. Zombies and an asteroid is coming to Earth just when all of our technologies went down. Perfect timing, right? But that could be possible because of one thing that I want to cover right now. The elites are planning something very significant for S September 24th. And a lot of people are expecting that this will be a World War III type of moment that will trigger something big. Some people think that it's OPEC abandoning the US dollar for oil trade, and others think that it's an EMP attack. Now, why would this be an EMP attack? And before I tell you why, actually, let me tell you why right now. The Homeland Security, okay, this is the official webpage of the United States Homeland Security, and they released a whole report on the DHS on how we're combating potential electromagnetic pulse attacks. And this was literally released about 15 days ago. So an EMP attack will take down all of your devices, all of your computers, all of your cars, all of your electricity, all of your telephones, all of that will go down in an EMP attack. Now, why do I think that this could happen? Because there was a massive coronal ejection that is expected to strike Earth on Friday, September 23rd, or September 24th. Now, what is this? Basically, it's a solar flare. It's like, this is a sun right here, and there was a big solar flare that burst a few weeks ago. And listen to what it can do to the world. Like, it can literally take down electric grids once it hits Earth, huge countries can go down and there will not have any electricity. So listen to this, because this is expected to hit Earth on September 23rd or the 24th, depending on where you are in the world. But watch this. Back parts of the US this week. A satellite built here in Colorado caught the eruptions on camera. The GO-16 satellite caught several solar flares in the past two days, prompting NOAA to issue a geomagnetic storm watch through Friday. Could cause fluctuations in the power grid, satellite irregularities, radio and GPS signals may temporarily fail. Now, I hope it just temporary fails and everything goes back to normal, but there is a lot of stuff that's pointing us to something big happening on September 30th or September 24th. And also September 30th is the last day, ironically, is the last day you can use the 20 pound note and the 50 pound paper notes. So after September 30th, you're gonna have to use the brand new polymer notes. And a lot of people think that they have a chip inside of them for a reason. And I wonder why they're doing that. The Bank of England on literally September 30th and on October 1st, the very next day, Germany is introducing new rules to combat the COVID-19 epidemic. Now, whether you believe in it or not, it's ironic also that October 1st was the date that Germany chose because if they have a problem right now, why would they not impose new guidelines, new rules today instead of waiting till October 1st? So it's very ironic that they, they're waiting to October 1st. So a lot of stuff is happening on September 24th, September 30th, as well as a big date as the Pope instructed Vatican entities to move all their money to Vatican banks by September 30th. So it's very ironic to see September 24th and September 30th in the Simpsons, in the German Parliament, in the European Union Parliament, and something big could be happening. Now, we speak a lot about cryptocurrencies on this channel, and a good way to keep your crypto safe in the event of the electromagnetic attack is to have your cryptocurrencies on a hardware wallet like this offline off of exchanges so that way 
You control your wallet, you control your keys, and you control your cryptocurrency. In this biometric wallet, you can get one or two using the links down below. Two is literally, the two pack is cheaper than an inner ledger. Right now you can get two for just $220. This also uses your thumbprint to get in with a seed phrase, so it's more secure than an inner ledger. It has a bigger screen. It connects your iPhone to your Android, and this holds thousands of cryptocurrencies. So what are you waiting for? This is a way to keep your cryptocurrency safe because you work hard to accumulate cryptocurrency so keep it safe with your decent hardware wallet using the links down below thousands of you already got it and they love it and you will love it as well so that is why september 24th and september 30th are two days to remember